pay to play that. Interesting. It's a wild character. Yeah, I saw the She's character. I there. really enjoyed it. And um, you know, Kim, I'm gonna tell you something. I'm learning though. I'm, I'm gonna be th- that. Uh, um, I want to just share uh, my friendship with you. I, 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 um, I have a lot of female friends. I noticed. Uh, what? I don't think people don't know that. <laughs> And they're all hot, hot women. Why is that? <laughs> well, I mean, baby, I Trey love. You know what I'm saying? This is Trey's love. If you wasn't married, you... You, you are so bad. No, I'm serious. If you wasn't married, girl, I'd cook you some pork and some, some ham. So you don't eat pork, huh? I'd make you some vegetables, some. I'd make you some cauliflower. <laughs> yeah, your husband's so going to be like, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah now, where you say he at? Yeah, I'm sorry, brother. I'm just serious. I, I, I would only feed your wife breakfast but good uh stuff. back yeah good <laughs> stuff so um how long is um so you got i heard you were telling me earlier too you have a kid situation that kind of slows some things down for you career-wise no, and necessarily. and you know what not not oh, necessarily well, giving it all up. i know oh, hey God. baby this is the trey love show I, this is we get down and dirty <laughs> off up in here <laughs> oh oh you you ain't even seen the cavity search don't oh. forget the boss is a doctor mario <laughs> mario bring the latex Oh my goodness, I'm nervous. <laughs> He's scared. We got a full body sir <laughs> no, I'm just I'm just serious. Um but yeah, like I was saying, um so you know, kids and everything. And something I find very interesting, um, you are uh your marriage is a um what's the word? Um biracial marriage, interracial. right? Yeah, interracial. So <laughs> a mother that was taking you to the gay parade, um a <laughs> Uh, interracial <laughs> no uh, interracial marriage no this is good stuff man this is what the Trey Love show is about and you're a phenomenal actress and you've made tons of money in commercials and films I want you to share with my viewers what um how do you think having being raised with your mother having that type of childhood affected you and um not that there's anything wrong because I and I like for people to do what it is they want but you know sometimes us we get rather, oh, well, why you had to do this and that. Do you think that um, your childhood influenced even the way you, you viewed um, your openness, which is great, to uh, homosexuality as well as interracial marriage? Mm, good question. Mm, I'm good. No, I th- you know what? It made me a strong person. Yeah. It made me a very strong person. Mm-hmm. I'm not, I'm, I love men, I by know. the way. I, I can tell. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> Let it, me stop it made me a very strong person and understand what life is, you know, about and change my whole personality not to, um, you know, just to understand how the way of living mm-hmm. goes. So not to be angry, not Absolutely. To, be, to be happy, have a good personality. Right. And a racial couple, I think, hey. I'm tall. I can't get a basketball player because they're all white ah, women, right? Or football players, right? Right, right, right. <laughs> they right. all got the white women. So why not go there? I think it's a beautiful thing. Well, you know what? It is a beautiful thing. And and um, myself being industry, I, you know, I want to share with the uh, with the people. You know, I um, of course, I know you know. Like I say, I have a lot of female friends, so to speak. But there is not a because of um the industry that we both are in and i had a rough childhood as well um there are some deep dark secrets about my parents past and things that i know that i'm when i go on oprah that's when i'm, I'm gonna tell everybody i'm like, oprah, yeah i ain't gonna even lie oprah and then and then but until then um for now we're just gonna go ahead and continue to talk about you but um beautiful beautiful this is working out so perfect for me but uh i just want to say that as an entertainer myself to the the gay community and to the african-american community as well and especially the males males tend to have such uh uh uh, the males we tend to be so man no man man get it get out of here with that but impressive right but see for our business i'm gonna say this in in our line of work in the entertainment industry i'm gonna say to the fellas yo don't let it fool you your hardest rapper, yeah. i just killed four people in the steeple then when he go in the makeup room you know who do his makeup Mm-hmm. I'd be like, come here, oh, 50 Cent, oh, <laughs> T.I. Mystical. You you know you did it, boy. When you, Lil Wayne, when you did that video, and I don't mean to be saying what? a brother's name specifically <laughs> or whatnot, but you know what I'm saying? But what I'm saying is, like, realistically, behind the scenes, there is so much um, of that lifestyle that if you want to be in this industry for you brothers out there that's trying to be so homophobic and so hard on a race of people even to the point like um and just making the point what i do love about your life is even with the interracial marriage thing i mean i kick it with a white girl and they oh trey you just sucker all right ladies and gentlemen it's been brought to my attention that the trey love show is running beautifully this week and guess what we got a clip we're gonna go to Kim Lancaster's <laughs> clip, y'all.
put your foot in that meal inside him. Mm. She always could cook even when we were kids. Mm. I don't know where she gets it from. Terry can't boil water. Hey, I have other channels. All right, you two, not tonight. Today we've come to celebrate Ashe. I cannot wait to open the doors tomorrow. I know this has been a dream of yours for a while and I am so glad to see it come true for you. We all should have dreams we work towards. That's what life is really all about, isn't it, Raymond? That's right. And we already know that Sada's a strong woman. <laughs> Whatever she wants, she gets. Take me, for instance. <laughs> oh, please, you know you wanted this first. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm so proud of you, sister. You've been working on getting this bookstore ready for a minute. I'm proud of you, too. I want to be just like you, a businesswoman and an activist. <laughs> How did you come up with the name Ashe? You know me. I love our people and our culture. And I wanted this store to be a place where we could all come together and just be ourselves. Ashe means, and so it is. And that's exactly what I want this store to embody. I want it to be a place where we can come together and be exactly who we are. With no drama and no explanation. And no drama and no explanation. I wish this family lived by those damn words. Damn, Terry, for once, can you just enjoy yourself and quit trying to make everything about you? I just made a statement. You, why don't you, big brother, stop trying to be in control all the damn time? Who's trying? Hey, damn. This is Asada's night. Can you please just be cool? Let's raise a toast. Yeah. Right. To Asada. To Ashe. 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 Yeah. <laughs> to Hui. Hey, hey Ru. Ru. Hey, Ru. To Nicole. And to Mary. To all the significant others here tonight. Oh. I don't have one. <laughs> Oh well, <laughs> I guess lesbians have a harder time. There you go with that shit again. Terry, take that chip off your shoulder. I mean, you my sister and I love you, but nobody cares about you being gay but you. You love me? <sighs> Stop fronting for all the people here tonight. Give me a break. Shabari, give me a break. No, I think you've had enough. Enough? Enough for what? Enough of the bullshit here with these people? Yeah, I had enough of that. Terry, please. Can we just enjoy this evening? Can you be happy for me? I am happy for you. Yeah, my sister. Hey, um, Masada, why don't you tell us all what inspires you to open up the bookstore? Know thyself. That's the key to living up to our full potential as people. I mean, we have got to learn to, to just be, be there for all the people we claim to love so much. Right, Huey? Right, Nicole? And Mary? And Raven! Terry, calm down. Nathan! Stop it! Terry, I'm tired of your shit! Sorry. You know what? Fuck this film! All right, ladies and gentlemen, you just saw the
fabulous work from this actress, Miss Kimberly Lancaster. Look, the Trey Love Show is about to sign off really quick. I know we're uh, running uh, close on time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give her the floor. Let her explain what it is. As you all saw, it's a soap opera. It has its comedy. I mean, not comedy. It has its uh, its tragedy and its uniqueness and talking about the lesbianism and everything. So go ahead and uh, tell the people what's going on real quick. Yeah, so that's the reason why I brought up the lesbian. Um, she, mm -hmm. I play a lesbian on this show, which mm -hmm. is... Uh, uh, Ashe, it's a black soap opera, um, but it it has so many different kind of things going on. It has drama, tragedy, um, sexuality, and I think in a lot of black communities, uh, we don't actually get to see a black woman um, uh, being a lesbian and betrayed by that, and uh, see you know see a lot of information about what's going on with with that because a lot of black women are lesbians so i've gotten a lot of um people wanting excited about the show and want to see what's going on with this character but it's really a good it's a good show um it it talks about brotherhood it talks about um so many different things um it it delves into like black everything so you have to check it out well <laughs> That's beautiful, ladies. I mean, uh, look at me, ladies. And I'm just so hyped because I'm excited too, Kim. Anytime women kiss, <laughs> I'm letting you know right now. I don't care. It, you, wherever women kissing, it can can I please get invited to where the women are kissing each other and they still want a little stiffy? All right, ladies and gentlemen, this has been another segment on the Trey Love Show. I am so happy right now. I'm excited. I had a wonderful guest. We're about to do a lot of hot butt naked things right now and have a good time once these cameras get off. <laughs> hey, you saw her. Check her out. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you... The movie is called what? It's actually a, a black soap opera. It's uh -huh. called Ashe.com. And there's so many crazy things that happen. I mean, it will keep you post you have to keep posting it'll keep it out. you uh, it'll crazy. keep you it'll keep yeah. you going i've checked so it watch out watch what happens next watch what happens next all right ashay.com <laughs> all right this has been the trey love show and i'm letting y'all know right now tune in next week same bad time same bad channel next week we got miss rapper uh uh drama gonza it's gonna be wild up in here y'all it's the one and only trey love the playboy comedy i want to <laughs> shout out and thank everybody who tuned in it's over baby Catch you on the next one, baby. Trey Love, Playboy Comedy, baby. Uh, Chuck, peace. I feel like a black panther. That's how I end it every week. Like I'm like this is like this. I'm letting y'all know. Let's dance a little bit. We got a group of people. All right, hey. Got Kim in the house. Got.